Yeah, hi guys. So let's look at this question here. This question says that find the last two digits of 76 raised to 84. Okay, so very good question. A lot of uh, concepts so will, will, will be revised for this last two digits. Okay, so look at all the concepts one by one. So find the last two digits of 76 raised to 84. Okay, so now basically I know that uh, this, is, this is a shortcut for all the numbers ending in one. Okay, so for example, uh, any last two digits ending in one, there is a shortcut like that, right? What is the shortcut here? The shortcut is, for example, if we have something like 41 raised to 24, 22. So how do we write it? So any power of one will always end in one and then four into two will become eight. So it is 81. Okay, so the tens digit here, so the tens digit here, that is four multiplied by the unit digit of power, that is eight. So 81, right? Similarly, if we have some uh, 61 raised to 37, okay. So any power of one will always end in one and a tens will be six into seven. So six into seven is 42. So last is two, so I'll, I'll take two away. So 21, like that. So basically, uh, now this is 76 raised to 84 here. So now I, I'll just try to break this as so 76 can, we can break this as something like uh, 2 is square into 19 raised to 84. Anna? Now this is 2 is, this becomes 2 raised to 168 into 19 raised to 84. Correct. Now both can be handled separately. So 2 raised to 68 into 19 raised to 84. Now 2 raised to, what is the pattern for 2? So the pattern for 2 is 2 raised to 10 into any odd power will always end in 24 Hena. and 2 raised to 10 any even power will always end in 76 will always end in 76 right okay so now can I say that uh, yeah so can I say that now basically though here we have got 168 so can I break like this so for 2 if I want to calculate for 2 raised to 168 so I can do separately you know so 2 raised to 168, I can write like this, 2 raised to 10 into some even number that is 16. So this is 160 and 8 will be left out. So this is 2 raised to 10, uh, that is uh, into any even will always end in 76. 76 into and 2 raised to 8. So 2 raised to 8 is basically 256. So its last two digits is 56. So I am concerned with only last two digits. Okay. So 76 into 56 will always end in 56 okay so 76 into 56 will always end in 56 right you can do it manually also okay also there's a property also that any 76 is a is a special is a special number here okay multiplied by any power of 2 that means any power of 2 so for example if we have 2 square that is 0 4 okay so 76 into 0 4 ends in 3 0 4 it's the same last to it okay that is 0, 04. Now 76 into 2 cube. That is 0, 08. Okay. So 76 into 0, 08 is 608. So again, last two is exactly 0, 08 here. So going with this pattern here, so 76 into uh, 2 raised to 8 is 256. So it will always end in last two is same, right? 0, 08, 0, 08, no? 0, 04, 0, 04. It is 56 and 56. So last two will be obviously 56. So I can rightly say that, right? So this is a peculiar number 76. So this is a, this is a property actually fine. Okay. So now, uh, what I got here is that, uh, hmm, okay, so now I can say that this 2 raised to 168 is ending in 56. So I can put 56 here. The last 2 is 56. Okay, now 19 raised to 84. Uh, so let's tackle this one also. 19 raised to 84, correct. See, so for 19 raised to 84, what will happen here? So I want to bring it at ending in one year. Okay, because ending in one we have a direct shortcut, right? So I, I know that nine is square will end in one and I know that nine is square will end in one. So I'll just try to bring in this form, right? So what I'm trying to do here is I'll try to bring this 19 raised to 84. My aim is to end, make it end in one. So 19 is square I can write here and then I can make it 42 here. Nine is square for you to find. That becomes, what is 19 square? It is 361, right? So basically it is 361. So 361 raised to some 42. Okay. 
so now my aim is oh, uh, my aim is uh, we have achieved your aim right so what is the part here that means th this is 361 so 61 raised to 42 so i can just see that what is the last two digits here so if it is ending in one so one raised to anything will always end in one and six into two is 12 so 12 last is two so 21 here that means this will this will be ending in 21 so 56 into 21 the last two digits of this is 821 right i hope you got this huh? okay so what is the answer now so 56 into 21 you can do manually that is uh, 56 into 21 is uh, uh, this 1120 and 1176 so 76 is the answer for this question okay so that's the way to go about it i hope you got this right okay the other 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 concept is here there is one more concept you can use in this question actually the cyclicity okay so you can write that cyclicity for last two digits is 20 that means after every 20 power the last two digit pattern repeats right means uh, if 76 raised to 1 is 76 then 76 raised to 21 will also be equal to 76 only because 76 basically ending in 76 not equal to basically ending in 76 so 76 raised to 21 also end in 76 because 76 i told that cycle cycle is 20 so after 20 76 raised to 21 is again equal to 76 raised to 1 76 raised to 22 is same as 76 square correct 76 raised to 23 is same as 76 raised to 3 that happens right so here we have i can say that we have got 76 raised to 84 here okay so 76 raised to 84 is equal to 76 raised to i can write some 20 power 20k that is 80 and 4 is left so this is uh th this this actually completely is this of no use right because after every 20 power it repeats so 76 raised to 84 is same as 76 raised to 4 76 raised to 4 is what is 76 square into 76 square so 76 square ends in 76 so 76 into 76 76 is the answer okay so it will always end in 76 that's the answer okay like here that's the funda of cyclicity okay so for any 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 uh, last two digits okay its cyclicity is 20 correct so after 20 power the last two digits will repeat that's the concept okay thank you and also also this combat guys okay so this uh, combat uh, you know it's a very good test series it contains some good high quality questions okay so their easy questions are, are not asked here so it basically it contains only good uh, medium and high quality questions with some uh, very advanced concepts okay and uh, uh, this from this sunday onwards it is in basically revised format so basically we are mo moving closer to cat right now so in january february and march we were like away uh, we are around eight to ten months away from cat so the questions we put off maybe some uh, easier or medium level right but this from now onwards the questions will be of higher higher level okay and uh, all the LRDA sets also um, this quant questions also and basically it's a fun it's fun right actually giving this is a fun because after every question you get you get, get, get your live ranking okay then uh, after every question the faster you answer the better your the better your rank is right you get more points so actually those one hour test is a fun and actually if you look at the cat you should give uh, multiple uh, sectional tests and tests before cat okay and this is one of your high quality tests absolutely free of cost and uh, now from uh, earlier it was not that rewarding but now they have introduced some uh, great rewards in this i think okay so rank one two three one year subscription i think around twenty thousand or seventy five percent scholarship or fifty percent so sir great prizes are on offer here okay so get it live from your mobile app you just put the in, uh, link here i'll uh, this uh, invite code you can put here ravi roda it ask you for invite code it is absolutely absolutely free of cost okay so ask you for invite code put ravi roda and the link i'll put in description just enroll from there okay and do give this every sunday do give this at 12 pm it's on every sunday okay so every sunday give this on 12 pm thank you